Hi everyone, Giuliano here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the annotation mode available in Microsoft Teams. During a meeting, a presenter, when shared a screen, is able to turn on the annotation mode. This empowers the collaboration with the audience because everyone is able to sketch and draw on the screen. There is, in fact, on top the whiteboard toolset which empower and allow users to add text, sticky notes, reaction, shapes, and so on. By doing that, you can real-time collaborate all together in the meeting when you share your screen. Okay, let's get started. Here I am in Microsoft Teams. I have a meeting, Teams annotation. Let me join it. Let me click on join now. And here I am in the meeting with my colleagues at Elevance and Lee Gu. Now I'm going to share my screen because annotations mode works only when you share your screen. Let me share my screen and just below here I have a PowerPoint presentation. Now to turn on the annotation mode, if you go up in the upper area of your screen, the toolbar of Teams will show up and here there is this pen with start annotation. Let's click on it. This will create a whiteboard instance behind and here we have right now a tool set. We can start to collaborate all together. For example, I can highlight specific area of my screen. I added an ellipsis shape here, then I can add, for example, this star reaction I can add here. And as you can see, in the meantime, my colleagues are collaborating with me in real time. Pretty cool. I can add, for example, or I can highlight this text message, or let's add even a text. Add more icons. Let's add a shape, for example. Let me select here this rectangle and let me add this rectangle. Here we go. So it's pretty cool. It's powerful and it seems that we are collaborating in the whiteboard, but I'm sharing my screen. This is very, very useful when you share your project, a roadmap, an architecture, whatever you want. But the point here is that you can collaborate in real time, like the whiteboard, but sharing your screen. Once you completed, remember to take a screenshot. All right, we have seen how to increase the collaboration during a Teams meeting using annotation mode. If you enjoyed this video, as always, please consider to subscribe, like, comment. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you next time.